In this video I want to show you how we built the function push to github in quick admin panel. So here I have a testing small panel and here I have a link push to github. If I click that uh, I'm able to log in as my github account and I've prepared a temporary repository in my personal github account which is empty for now. So what I need is push that to github. I authorize the access Okay, I need a password here. Okay, and now it's scanning the repositories and then you choose the repository you want. The latest one, that's exactly what I want and it's pushing. And now the job is in the queue and it will push in, in a matter of seconds and I will get email as soon as it's done. Here it is, the email about success and now let's go to repository and refresh that. I have a new branch and committed the whole project. And now if we want to make some changes for that CRUD, for example, we want to edit some field to be, for example, required. Uh, this one, for example, required. We save the CRUD, so the files have been regenerated here. And I will push to GitHub again to the same repository, push. It should be much quicker. And now let's refresh again. And you should see, oh, it's not done yet. Yep, new pull request, new branch, and then it should be a pull request. Yep, so, so we create a new branch, so we don't delete and don't override anything. Uh, there is a new branch, which is called quick admin panel something date and automatic commit which is exactly what has been changed so i've uh, added the file the field to be required so it is required in requests then new migration for change and then star here in the view file in edit so that's it uh, in this way by making changes with small changes with quick admin panel you can push your changes to the branch and then you are able to merge resolve conflicts if there are any and continue with our project.